welcome back to our tack and daughters and you should have known this was coming if i had bursa mags on monday here it is it should be wednesday uh, if i do it right and we got us a bursa 380 thunder that we got at our local pond our local gun shop our lgs this is the thunder 380 made in don't cry for me argentina it's got the hillary hole off and on switch this one i don't have the extra off and on switch but it is on fire it has plastic grips it has an aluminum frame there and it has a steel barrel it has a slide stop slide release it is empty as you can see here and uh, you got your takedown lever on this side right here uh, you can see the trigger operate kind of like a Beretta. Uh, this is Bursa's copy. Well, their version of a PPK or PPK, however you want to think about it. Um, so I got this for the low, low price of 180 tacos out the door. With the background ill check, it was used. And I figured, well, you know, I was going to buy one for my 380 challenge. But uh, I didn't want to pay, you know, depending on where you get them at, they're like 300 tacos or 270 tacos. 180 was just fine for me, for for my purposes. So anyway, so we got that slide stop, slide release works. The uh, has rear cocking serrations, doesn't have none on the front. It does have uh, manual sights with adjustments. I thought that was odd. It had adjusted. adjustable rear sight. Nice. Uh, they are white dots, so my bad eyes should be able to see it. It does have a um, safety and a decocker. So there you go. Um, so if you got the safety on, the mag, if you got the safety on, you can see the hammer pop out. Pop in, it pops out, so it's a hammer block. Um, crazy new light that I got. I don't have to, I'm about to pull off the. Uh, the motion to sensor even though i was making motions it should have went on anyway uh magazine release is right there where it's good to go um it came with one mag which was the sad part about it and then so we're back to the safety here so you can do like that now the safety's down all the way double action um uh oh i did something didn't i magazine oh it's got a magazine disconnect so, yeah, I didn't push the magazine in all the way. Stupid magazine disconnect. So, uh, maybe this this is the McCluskey gun, the McCluskey chick gun, except this one actually works. So, we'll see how that works out, won't we? Anyway, um, yeah, yeah, back back to the features here. It's got a plastic grip. Um, we need to get some good grips for this thing. Some rubberized ones would probably be better. Like I said take down lever on this side it is for right-handed people if you're wrong-handed sorry about your luck again that's the trigger action there um, single action trigger goes back that far it is so you got that much play in it squeeze and then boom so boom let's see here Reset on single action pull. You're coming out there real far, right there. Yeah, and then boom. So uh, the reset ain't bad. It is what it is. This is not um, a high dollar gun by any use. Is it slightly better than a high point? We'll find out because this is the first Bursa 380 Thunder that I own. The Bursa 9mm B. P C C where the hell is nine? Um, that gun phenomenal shoots really well. Hopefully, I won't be disappointed in this one, and we'll find out why they got rid of it. <laughs> Other than maybe just have one magazine, and then we'll get to put we'll put the first magazine through it, which will be the factory one, and then we'll use these pro mags and watch me cry and say, oh no. So I get a 90% success rate out of pro mags. I got a 50-50 chance with one of these working and the other one not. So how about that? Anyway, let me know what you think about the Bursa 380 and what do you think about the 380 caliber. Uh, I like it personally. I think it's a good option for carry, especially in the summertime, especially when it's hot. 
and it's going to be a little bit stainless steel or aluminum we're going to, have to worry not stainless steel but aluminum we won't have to worry about it rusting except for the slide and we can take care of that these guns been around an awful long time bursa's got a factory here in the u.s now they're making ar-15s now so can't wait to see how those go stay tuned for more of the bursa first shots video and then first impressions after that and then a full review so anyway thanks for watching please like share and subscribe to the channel and we'll catch you guys and gals next time remember it cost what is it called it costs nothing to be kind to one another costs nothing to be kind of one another one another okay anyway and the last words emmett's <laughs>